All right, hello everyone, it's Team Rocket Dross here with another Pokemon card opening. And for this video, guys, we're gonna be opening the new Pikachu V Box. So here we have it. And I don't know if I'll be able to show you the whole thing, I just don't have the room. But here we have it. If you guys wanna look at the back, um, that's what it contains. And if you guys wanna read what it says, then oh, I was able to get it. All right, so just pause the video and read it. And uh, yeah, so let's get to opening it and see what kind of goodies we get inside. All right, first things first, guys. Here we have the code card. Uh, I wasn't doing this before giving these out, but you know what? If you guys, um, yeah, I just haven't used them. So here you guys go. All right, so to start off, guys, here we have one of the cards that you guys saw in the front. Um, here we have Mimikyu. Hopefully it's all, you guys are able to see it and everything. Let me see if I tap it. No, it won't work. Um, but yeah, so here we have, what if I do this? All right, so we'll see. I don't know, guys. I don't know if you guys are able to see this. I'm still learning how to use my camera, so I apologize if uh, something's not right. But um, let's check it out. So it's Mimikyu, and it has the ability Heal Jamming. Uh, your opponent's bench Pokemon can't be healed, and he also and it also has cl uh, Class Slash for 30 for 2 energy. And this is 81 out of 189, and I believe this is Darkness of Blade. No, no, this is, um, oh, what is that pack set called? Oh, wow, is the one with, no, I can't remember the, the pack. I was trying to remember, guys, um, but it's that set symbol right there. Uh, it's one of the recent ones where the single strike and the rapid strike were introduced. I'm just just completely getting camera just I don't know guys I can't remember I'll try to remember in just a little bit um, but here we have it pretty good and uh, yeah so it's not a black star promo which is pretty interesting I feel like I've, I have the promo of that card um, I believe I got it in one of the blisters or one of the CVS uh, tents like short tents and then we also get this Pikachu right here, which is pretty interesting. Pikachu V. It is a Black Star promo, so we're in Shield 198. And it has Lightning Blast for 100 plus for 3 energy. You may discard all electric energy from this Pokemon. If you do, this attack does 120 more damage. Wow. Pretty interesting card right here. It's pretty cool. I always like my Pikachu uh, cards. I don't know about you guys, but for some reason, I don't like the Vs. I don't like the, the style of, of like the V cards. I prefer the EX style. That was a really good style where um, it would still have like the normal card kind of like layout where it would have like the rectangle, but then the Pokemon would be coming out a little bit. Like I really like that style. Um, I'm not the biggest V card fan i don't know it's just something about it that i mean it's cool but it's not as cool as the other ones if that makes any sense but if you guys want to check out um the back right here it's uh centered pretty decently actually it might be a little bottom to top but overall it's actually pretty decently um thing and then we obviously get our jumbo card right here which is the same as our regular v card but just a lot bigger so yeah going that's going into my collection and then we also get four booster packs so we get fusion and brilliant stars so we get two of each so pretty interesting usually they have um at least three different sets but for this one we got these right here so we're just going to save the brilliant stars uh for last since uh that's the newest set and we'll start off with the fusion strike which uh i'm really excited about I like this set. I opened the booster box from this set. I got decent pulls. Uh, and I'm just looking at, you know, trying to get all the other ones. And I just wanted to mention, guys, that I did actually. So last week, if you guys are kind of like a weekly schedule where you guys look at my uh, videos that I upload, I uh, at least upload one uh, card opening a week. Uh, this past week, I tried something new with the camera and I was not happy with it, guys. I completely didn't like it, so I didn't uh, upload the video. Um, but I will see if I could show you guys what I pulled. Uh, just in case you guys were wondering, I ended up opening the Leafeon 
one uh, premium collection box. I the one before that was the Glaceon, um, but I ended up opening that one, and unfortunately, like I said, it just didn't work out for the video. Um, it was just way too bright. I also did a new setup where I didn't have my Funko Pops. I had a backdrop and I had a lot more space, but overall, I just I was not happy with it, so I just didn't upload it. Um, so our reverse is gonna be a Vicavolt, guys, which is so rare. This is actually a really nice art. One of the better ones, I would say. Wow, that's pretty cool. Um, I guess when it goes more into like a natural, like place where Pokemon would be, they tend to kind of like they tend to stand out a little bit more um, instead of just having like a up front, you know, just the Pokemon with. You know, just a small background. Even the snowball is pretty cool. But for example, like this one, where it's just mainly the Pokemon, there's nothing really um, in the back and stuff like that. It, it doesn't really like have much interest. But then if you add like this really nice background to it, it just makes it completely stand out. All right. So for the last card and a rare, guys, we did not get an ultra rare, but a regular rare Blissey. Not bad. All right. So now for the second pack. All right, but yeah, like I said, I, I did get a decent pull, so I do want to show you guys that way you guys can see basically what I ended up getting, and at least it's on video, you know, that I pulled this, and so a lot of the cards that I pulled uh, were on video for recent sets. I haven't bought anything recently for the new sets. Here's the code card. Um, but yeah, one, two, three, four. And since I'm also almost done with my binder, ultra rare binder, I kind of want to show you guys that way you guys were like, wait, when did you get that one? You know? Um, so that's why I also want to show you guys. Uh, so we got a Shauna, we got Victini cause like every now and then I do open cards off camera, but it's a rare thing that I do that, you know? So I try to catch everything. So our reverse is going to be a ball toy, guys, which is a common. And for the last card, guys, and a rare, it seems like it is an ultra rare. And it might be a, a VMAX or a full art. Or I don't know what it is, guys. It's just not a regular V. Or at least it doesn't seem like it. I've been wrong before. But let's see what we ended up pulling. We ended up getting... Oh, it is a regular V. Okay, we got a Cinderace. There we go. Now, like I mentioned before, I was completely wrong. I don't know why I thought it was a different one. Huh, that's interesting. I don't know why it made me think it was a different one, but we got Cinderace V, which um, it has flare for 50 for two energy. And we also got all out shot for 210 for four energy. During your next turn, this Pokemon can't attack. And this is 44 out of 264. All right, so I don't know if I have this one. This seems kind of familiar, but at the same time, it doesn't. I don't know if I pulled it in, uh, like, in the recent, I don't know, in the past month or two. Um, I'm not sure if I've opened it. And these are a little tight. I don't really like that they're so tight, but um, it is what it is, guys. It's not bad. You guys can see. It's just it's a little harder squeeze in there. Um, but, yeah, so not bad. Pretty cool card right here start setting these on the side so so far we only pulled one ultra rare all right so now for the first brilliant stars which i'm still working on the booster box guys so we're gonna be end up going on part three so if you guys want to check out my booster box brilliant stars booster box opening i'm splitting it into up oh, i guess we saw what we ended up getting there here's a code card into four parts so far i've done two so you guys could expect the other two soon um, i'm trying to kind of like do one video booster box and then one like box one of these normal boxes in between that way it's not just nothing but booster box you know just kind of spread it out a little bit um so if you guys are interested in that that should be coming soon um another thing was I do have a Hoopa and a Dragonite as well as an Elite Trainer box for Brilliant Stars. So that's another good thing right there. So if you guys are interested, stay tuned. And then I'll probably be ordering another one. Oh, okay, so I do have another Pikachu V box, but I, I don't know if I want to keep that in my collection. Um, I feel like I want to keep that since I already opened one. Um, I kind of have like a sealed collection box and I don't know uh, if it comes to it. If like one day I don't have product for a week, we end up getting oh a hollow Empoleon. 
um, if I end up not having like one day like any card openings or anything to open um, I'll probably open it but I'll try to keep it in my sealed collection as long as I can I have a lot of things like that that I'm just like saving that I try not to open but if you know one day it comes to it um, then you know then I have no choice but to open it so let me just sorry guys my phone just went off uh, let's leave this puppy up and check it out all right so actually this is a really nice hollow I don't believe I have it I don't think I've seen this one let me do it a little bit more and it's Empoleon this, actually, this hollow is actually nice I just don't like this type of hollow where it's like lines I forgot what it's called um, I don't know I've never been a fan of that type of hollow uh, I guess this is kind of like a rat where it's like I don't like this I don't like that sorry guys I don't mean to do that it's just you know just making my mind stuff that stand out I mean I still like it obviously I'm not hating on it but I just these are not my favorite ones if, if that makes any sense it's probably in the last in line doesn't mean I hate it it just means that I'm not you know I prefer the other ones over this one I guess that's a better way of saying it right um, we also got the ability emergency surfacing once they're in your turn if this Pokemon is in your discard pile and you have no cards in your hand you may put this pokemon onto your bench if you do draw three cards wow that's actually pretty handy right uh, we also got water arrow for one energy this attack does 60 damage to one of your opponent's pokemon with one energy it does 60 so this actually i don't know if this would be since it is a, a second uh, stage card how that would work out um and for the last one guys all right, so we'll see if the quality of this video is decent. Like I said, I'm still struggling. Um, right now I'm using a 200, one out of one over 200 uh, shutter speed. I also have uh, my ISO at 1600. Um, so if you guys know anything about uh, cameras, then yeah, that's what I'm working on with right now. All right, so here's the code card, guys. Hopefully, you guys get something good. Uh, one, two, three, four. And I forgot that the I believe there's something. Yeah, the subset, right? There's a subset which would be in the reverse hollow spot. So I need to remember that. All right, guys. Now for the last one, we got a water energy. We got Staravia. We have a Gloria right here. Go bite. Elect the bus. We got a Bidoof. Really cool Bidoof. And we have a Clefairy. Grimer. Nope. One more execute. Did we get a subset card? Nope. We ended up getting an Electrovire, which should be a rare, and it is a really cool card right here. Bam! It's like doing some sort of attack, like Thunder Punch or something, because you guys can see a little bit of lightning. Um, but yeah, so, alright guys, so now for the last card of the pack, guys, and the video. Did we get an Ultra Rare? Oh, it seems like we didn't. We ended up getting a regular Rare Wormadam. Oh, man. Look at the, the, oh, the background's so cool. It seems like really realistic. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's actually pretty cool. Um, and then the, the actual Pokemon seems like it's uh, like made out of clay. It's like one of those clay pictures with the realistic background. But just the, the shadows on it really stand out. So it's actually pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so the actually the, the outside of the border is really bad right here. It's not cut whatsoever in any way. But yeah, guys, so here are the pulls that we ended up getting. If there's, uh, let me know in the comment section below if you guys ended up opening this box. And let me know what kind of pulls you guys ended up getting. But that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos. And I guess I'll just catch you guys on the next one. Team Rocket Draws, out.